Guess what, people? I'm in my favorite country, Poland. Um, I don't think I could ever get enough of Poland. Um, I'm in a place called Gdansk. Um, Gdansk is a city up north. Um, it's quite popular in terms of tourism. So what I thought I'll do this time is I'll show you my room. Um, I've decided to book an Airbnb this time instead of actually getting a hotel. Because I thought, you know, I need to be more spontaneous in my trips. Um, I, I tend to book like bougie hotels and sometimes, you know, four star hotels. Um, but this time I thought, you know, let me get an apartment and see how it feels. Actually, this is a studio, a studio apartment. Um, it's a one bedroom studio apartment and um, I think it's really good. Okay, let's go through what they have. So, this is a little cabinet. And it's got like um, an iron. It's got a hoover. That's interesting. Um, it's got a microwave. I think I'm gonna buy myself some chicken wings and warm it here. You know I love my chicken. Okay, um, that's a lovely oven. I don't think I'll be doing any cooking anyway. So, um, when I've booked Airbnbs in other places, um, especially within the UK, I've never ever cooked um, because I don't like cooking um, in an Airbnb. It's not, it's not me anyway. Especially when I'm on holiday, I never cook. Um, that's a no-no. Okay, so they have a very, very nice sink. Um, I think a lot of things would be washed here. I love washing dishes, that's my specialty. I'm in the wrong job, I should be washing dishes in kitchens. <laughs> um, so they have um, a place here to put all your rubbish. I suppose what they expect you to do um, is to put food waste and other types of waste in various places. Um, that's what I'm guessing because that's what I do in the UK. So in the UK, um, I put food waste in a certain place, I put plastic in a certain place, um, and I put cardboard in a certain place. So I suppose in Gdansk is similar. My Polish people correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> okay, so um, all my days, they have a dishwasher. I've never actually seen an Airbnb that has a dishwasher. This is a first. That's good. Okay, so the good thing about this Airbnb is um, they've done it in such a way that um, it's got like a hotel vibe. So even though it's a studio apartment, um, it's got like a nice oven. It's got a nice oven like I've shown you. It's got a nice place for cooking as well. Um, so it's got like an electronic thing here that you press and voila you start cooking so like I said um, I'm not looking to cook so I don't want to mess it up it looks so um, complicated <laughs> you see I'm even lost of words yeah normally when I go to a place I know what to say but this looks really complex um, I'm, I'm used to gas cookers anyway I don't use electric cookers um, so I'm just going to leave that anyway regardless um, okay so I suppose this is what you switch on um, when you want to get rid of all the smoke can you hear that sound I love that sound bang okay switched it off so um, I suppose some people might cook um, because some people tend to cook when they go on holidays I'm not that sort of guy Okay, so you have a big screen TV, um, that's quite good, that's quite nice. Um, and also you've got um, wine glasses, um, glasses for shots and things like that. There, that's my, um, my bag and my little suitcase um, that I normally use when I'm traveling within Europe. So what I tend to do is when I travel within Europe, I don't take um, a lot 
because I usually spend like four or five days within Europe. So um, I don't take a big suitcase. But when I go to places like India, Vietnam, uh, Malaysia, places like that, then I go with the big suitcase um, because I take a lot of clothes. Um, okay, um, this is my little um, area of rest. Um, I'll be doing a lot of resting because I need it. I'm a hard working man. You all know this, I work really hard. Um, that looks nice. Um, I wonder where they got that from. Um, it might be Ikea, but who knows. I've got a little dining room, just me, myself, and I. Did you see that? Me, myself, and I. That's what's gonna happen here. I'm just going to be alone editing videos anytime I get back home. Um, the plan for tonight is to go to a shisha bar um, to talk to the locals anyway because um, what I tend to do is when I go to a certain area I like talking to the locals um, just to find out how they are. Um, it's a good way of gauging how um, a country or a place is when you speak to the locals. Okay let's talk about the bathroom. Um, it's very important for your bathroom to be top-notch because you do a lot of cleaning in your bathroom. So, um, the bathroom actually is really nice. Um, I think this place is so similar to a hotel. So, so similar. So, the usual standard shower gel and shampoo. Uh, what's funny though is, anytime I travel abroad, I always bring my shower gel and um, my toothpaste and everything, yeah? But what tends to happen is when I travel to these hotels and these places They always have a shampoo ready for me and a shower gel So I end up taking mine back because why should I use mine when they already have one there for me? Okay, um, so this is a nice area to brush your teeth wash your face. Let's see what they have in here Oh, they've got a hairdryer um, so you wouldn't catch me using a hairdryer anyway because I've got no hair um, As you can see my hair <laughs> My hair is not that long so um, You wouldn't catch me using this but oh well they've got the baby lace um, hairdryer um, And it's not going to get used at all because I don't actually need one Okay, oh a lot of toilet rolls um, mm, Interesting, interesting um, hopefully I don't need them. Um, I don't think I could get Deli Belly in Poland, especially Gdansk. Um, Gdansk is known for having good food, so I wouldn't be visiting the toilet that often. <laughs> um, no offence to my Indian subscribers, yeah? Okay, um, so they've got a little cabinet. There's a lot of cabinets in this place though. There's a lot of places to keep stuff. Oh my days, are you kidding me? They've got a washing machine. Are you for real? This, nah, this, this Airbnb is different. This is totally different. I've never seen this before. So what you're telling me is I could chop my clothes in here. If I knew I should have brought my gym clothes because I was thinking, because they have a gym, yeah? And I was thinking if I bring my gym clothes, I don't want to put them back in my suitcase because it might stink. <laughs> So I thought, you know what, no jibbing, but I made a mistake, yeah, I should have done that. But I'll check to see if I can wear some of the clothes I have. Um, I might do a gym session. Should I? Should I not? I'll see. Anyways, they've got a washing machine. That is really good. Um, it might be good to um, look at investment opportunities in Poland because if one can buy a property in Poland, I use it for Airbnb, I think it would be a good idea. Um, and, and the thing I like about Poland is everything they have is always up to standard. You know, I've been to a lot of places in Poland, um, I've been to Warsaw, I've been to Krakow, I've been to Wroclaw, I've been to Katowice. So I've been, if I'm pronouncing it wrong, please don't laugh. <laughs> um, I've been to Poznan and now I'm in Gdansk, yeah? And Poland never, ever, ever disappoints me. Yeah? It never disappoints me. Every time I come to Poland, um, I'm always impressed. Every time. 
Okay, let's shut the door. Let's be a gentleman and shut the door. Okay, so um, they've got a lot of controls here. I've got no idea. Um, I suppose it's when people from downstairs want to come in, wherever the case may be. Um, let's see what we have um, in this little wardrobe. Oh, they've got a place where you can hang your stuff. Um, okay, let me switch on my light so you can see that. So that's a place to hang stuff. Okay. I understand now. Um, let's see what they have in the fridge. Do you think they have champagne? Do you think Poland gives people champagne in their Airbnbs? Let's check it out. Okay, so this is where the fridge is. I'm waiting for my champagne bottle. Oh my days, I'm disappointed. Water. Why don't I have a bottle of champagne? or even a bottle of Polish vodka. Oh well. All right, so I think I'm going to have to end it here. Um, what are my plans for Gdansk? Um, I plan to go on a tour tomorrow morning with other tourists, just to have an idea of how the old town is and the main city. Um, also, before I, you know, I tour around the old town and um, the main city, I'll show you my local area tomorrow morning. So, um, if you want to stalk me, feel free to stalk me, yeah? Um, I'll be walking around my Airbnb area to show you how the local area is. Um, there's a lot of construction being done in my local area. I did notice that whilst um, I was traveling towards my Airbnb. Um, but it is a nice area. Um, there's a lot of development. I suppose they are trying to create more, you know, more um, properties or make more properties for tourists and locals um, as well. Anyways, um, I'm going to have to leave it here. Um, if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. Um, if you haven't liked my videos and you actually like my videos, um, please like it and I'll catch you in my next video. Take care, guys.